When Real to Reels rolled on the market, it was a big deal because previously you could only record maybe a few minutes and it was, it was a really difficult process to create a wax cylinder or press a vinyl. It wasn't something that you're, anyone could do. Suddenly with reel to reel tapes, magnetic tape, anyone with a machine and the will to record could create these long recordings. And that was key, is that you could actually store uh, and record and store up to maybe three or four hours, depending on the speed you were recording at. And, uh, and you could do so quite easily. And so this was really a revolution in recording technology and changed, um, changed everything. It enabled uh, people to record basically anything they wanted, and soon it enabled them to record that anywhere as the machines themselves got smaller. So while the reel-to-reel -reel revolutionized recording, the next step was the cassette tape, which really revolutionized things. It gave people the ability to record the radio and to create mixtapes, and really made it far more accessible than it had ever been and really was the first form of pirating or downloading. Um, of course, you'd have to still do it in real time. But these cassette tapes became so easy to use and really personalized our ability to record because they had handheld recorders for the first time. You could actually carry the device to an event and subsequently, poets and other artists would be carrying around these recorders with them. And from those experiences, we have all these tapes, including uh, many of the tapes in our archives.